Hi fiends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 244 in Best Fiends. This one is called Dangerous Moves. Our goals are to defeat six slugs and open eight crates. These are the metal crates, so we'll have to bring them down to the bottom so that they can be released once they hit this metal demagnetizer, is what I'm going to decide to call it. All right, so let's take a look at this. We have got dynamite down here, so we've got to get to this detonator. We've got a rocket that can help us do that, and it's going to change direction every other. We have got traps. That's not so fun. We've got slime. We've got slugs, but I don't see them as hairy slugs. They don't, they're not affiliated with any particular color as far as I can see. So let's go ahead and take a look at which fiends we have and which we want to bring in. So we've got yellow, blue, green, red. I don't see purple. There may be purple showing up later, but right now there's no purple on the board. Uh, so I'm not too terribly worried about Whisper. Moose is nice and strong, reaches into places that are harder to get to. Vincent is strong, Buggles and Vega. Yeah, I like all these guys. Let's go ahead and start here and see what we can do. Obviously hitting this is going to be important and taking out the stumps is good. So let's do this. So we hit that det detonator just once because the rocket is not like one of our bombs. In order to free things, we have to open up the traps and I do like doing that. It just frees the board more. All right, so let's take this. This will now reset to go this way so we can hit that detonator again because we've, we're trapped here. But look at this, I can take out a trap and I can hit that detonator and of course I'm taking off the slime from the cages. So that is handy and helpful. All right, let's go ahead and grab the blue. I like that. It's going to take off some slime here. It's going to reposition this. Now I've got green. and I'm going to go ahead and take it and blow everything up. There we go. That's nice. So those are done. Now we'll start getting cages from up here that we can access. Now I have to re consider what my options are and where I want to make my choices. I think I'm going to go with this nice long string of yellow. That'll defeat that slug entirely and get me to the next slug. And of course it's helping Vega to build up her uh, bomb meter. This would help me bring the crates downward plus it sets off the rocket and then I can bring the crates down further with all this red that's going to connect. I still don't have that open. Oh, but look at this. Now I've got some fun things. I like all this red. Watch what happens here. Look at how much red I can collect. That's 29,000 points. It hits the detonator. It brings down the crates, but it does not take out the other bombs. And so I still have whatever points and, and benefit those uh, will be able to give me and more bombs so I like that still can't get this one cleared now if I do this Vega gets filled I set off a bomb and I get 27,000 points that's not bad if I do this that's just 8300 I don't set off any bombs there's nothing spectacular if I do this, I bring this down somewhat, but I'm going to wait. I'm going to do what gives me the most points. Wait, what is, if I do this, I get two, two bombs set off and it changes the rocket. So 3,100, what was my other one that I could do? Wasn't it just collecting this? Yeah, I'm going to do the one not only because it gives me more points, but because it sets the rocket at the detonator. So it will collect this as well once this, oh, hello, or that happens. I don't understand why that happened, but I will take it. I will not complain about that at all. If I do this, I can hit the detonator again. Well, I can hit the rocket and the detonator. So that works well and it keeps Vega's bomb and it gets rid of that slug. Yeah, I like that. We're heading this one down toward the base. 
And now look at this. I can do this and it takes out everything under those crates and it gives me 25,000 against that slug. So hopefully the crates will be gone. They'll not be an issue. And then I'll just have the remainder of this slug left and I've got a bomb to help with it, but not really. All right, so now I'm just going for points. And that's all I need. But even though I'm just going for points, look, there's a carrot and I need a baby slug taken care of. I'm going to go for that one. And it's going to leave a bomb on the board and it may give me a new bomb and I will get extra rewards for that. I'll be able to get... Oh, I still didn't get him. I was on my second to the last slug. Yeah, Susie, time to wake up. All right, here we go. I still have 10 moves. I can do it, right? should be able to. I still can't get that open. This is still not valuable. So let's go points wise. That gets me 4,300. This gets me 8,200 plus hits the detonator. I don't think I'm going to be able to get any better than that. So let's take the 8,200 here. Plus Moose is getting filled up. We may get a bomb from Moose. Oh, hello. That's kind of nice, and that almost does the trick. Almost. 27,000 that way, 25,000 that way, plus I get a carrot. Should I look for something better? I can look. I just don't think I would get anything better. That takes out that bomb that I had on the board. I like it. Okay, and now I've got bombs on the board. I also have a slug sliming the place up. All right, this should do it, right? Yes, look at that. This time I can actually get it done. I'm not, it's not a mirage. That's done, all slugs gone. There we go, and I still have seven. And I still have bombs, look at that. Beautiful stuff happening with those shamrocks. That should be enough to get me that portion complete because I'll get a bonus for winning the game and I get a baby slug. Lots of fun stuff. And I'm going to open up the cages automatically. I like diamonds. I like yellow meteor mites. Yeah, the blue meteor mites. I have a few too many of those in comparison. All right, so I get four keys as my reward for completing the shamrock challenge number four. And I get baby Lisa. She's done growing up. I'm going to keep going because I have the opportunity to play some today. Otherwise, I should stop. And then uh, I'm not quite done with Minutia's Top Baker, but that did help me because I needed to uh, complete one baby slug stage. So I'm on the way there. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. Remember that if you don't have these events, generally you'll have different events going on. So you'll still get some events. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.